The INFJ, with its traits of empathy, intuition, and visionary spirit, is a distinctive and fascinating personality type in a world full of different personalities. But a true INFJ's deep intelligence frequently comes with a set of traits that unintentionally scare and alienate people. This rope examines eight strong arguments for why people may find it disturbing to deal with an INFJ's intelligence. The eighth is comprehension with empathy. The unmatched empathy of the INFJ lies at the core of their mysterious appeal. These people have a natural capacity to probe people's emotions and frequently reveal feelings that are buried. Although others may find this sympathetic disposition endearing, it can also cause discomfort for others. Those who are not used to this level of closeness may find it uncomfortable because of the great understanding that an INFJ provides. The INFJ's astute observations have the ability to inadvertently reveal the layers people would rather keep buried, causing discomfort that causes some people to withdraw. Though a distinguishing feature of the INFJ, this sense of empathy can unintentionally act as a barrier, intimidating and intimidating others with their emotionally probing stare. Those around INFJs may find comfort in the warmth of connection or shrink from the unnerving sensation of being truly seen as they carefully balance their empathetic powers. Seventh, perception and wisdom. The other side of the INFJ's fascinating intelligence is its unmatched sense of intuition and perceptive comprehension of human motivations. INFJs are nearly magical at reading between the lines. They can accurately decipher motivations and hidden meanings. They can traverse intricate social relationships thanks to their intuitive prowess, but it can also be unsettling for others who aren't used to having their intentions made clear. People may feel exposed by the INFJ's astute insights, as though their innermost thoughts are on display. Even with the best of intentions, this acute awareness can unintentionally cause discomfort for others, causing them to shy away from the INFJ's piercing stare. The INFJ must walk cautiously in this fine line between intuition and engagement, combining their perceptive nature with an awareness of the discomfort it may cause. While the INFJ's intuition is a potent tool for understanding, it may also be frightening for people who aren't ready to have their inner selves revealed when it comes to relationships. Sixth, high standards and idealism. INFJs are idealists who strive for perfection in both themselves and their environment. They approach life with a vision of a better world. Although commendable, this dedication to high standards might cause a gulf between the INFJ and others who could find their expectations intimidating. The INFJ's quest for an idealistic reality could unintentionally draw attention to the flaws in the current situation, making some people feel inferior or unable to live up to the high expectations established by their INFJ counterparts. Despite the INFJ's sincere desire for development and progress, some people may be intimidated by their utopian viewpoint and avoid accepting the implied challenge to uphold higher standards. In their pursuit of a better tomorrow, INFJs must walk a tightrope between inspiration and intimidation. Finding a balance between their vision and the realities of the outside world becomes a delicate dance. Number 5. Independent thinking. The propensity of an INFJ to think independently and frequently march to the beat of their own drum is fundamental to their brilliance. Although those who value conformity may view their autonomy as frightening, it is a sign of their power and originality. Because of INFJ's distinctive viewpoints and innovative ideas, which sometimes go against social conventions, some people find it difficult to consider adopting an unorthodox way of thinking. The independence of the INFJ might unintentionally be interpreted as a rejection of long-standing customs, which could make people uncomfortable who find solace in the known. The INFJ's independent thinking can cause tension in an environment that may be resistant to change, and some people may want to disassociate themselves from the perceived threat to the status quo as a result. However, this freedom also contains a reservoir of inventiveness and invention which, despite frightening some, 
promotes development and expansion in the constantly changing fabric of ideas. Complex communication is number four. An INFJ's intelligence is frequently demonstrated by their complex and subtle communication style. Despite the richness and depth of their words, people who value direct communication may unintentionally become hostile due to their intricate style of speech. INFJs have a tendency to spin complex stories and delve into depths of meaning that could make it difficult for certain listeners to stay up. This complex communication style, which is a reflection of their complex inner lives, may be off, putting to people who prefer interpersonal interactions to be straightforward and unambiguous. People who are not used to reading between the lines of an INFJ's writing may not understand the depth of their observations, which can lead to a disconnect. Some INFJs may find the intricacy of their communication daunting as they strike the careful balance between communicating their deep ideas and making sure others comprehend them, leading them to retreat from the struggle of unraveling the complicated web of their ideas. However, there is a wealth of knowledge and insight hidden inside this intricacy that, for those who are prepared to investigate, provides a fruitful voyage into the depths of profound comprehension. Third, a reserved attitude, a quiet and secluded demeanor that adds to an aura of mystery that can both draw people in and make them uncomfortable is ingrained in the persona of an INFJ. Although the reason for their restrained behavior is to safeguard their private space, others may unintentionally feel cut off from them as a result. The INFJ's propensity for self-reflection and selective disclosure could be interpreted by others as coldness or apathy, which makes them reluctant to engage in more meaningful relationships. They can be fascinating and terrifying in the same way that their reserved facade is mysterious, making people who are looking for instant gratification retreat. For those who are not used to the gradual unfurling of layers, the INFJ's restrained manner can be difficult to navigate as they tread carefully between disclosing and keeping things hidden. However, the quietness belies a rich inner world that begs to be discovered, a terrain of ideas and feelings that, to those who are patient enough, reveals the full scope of the INFJ's personality. Leading with vision is number two. An INFJ's innate propensity for visionary leadership is entwined with their intelligence. These people have an inbuilt capacity to imagine a future that advances innovation and progress by going beyond the current quo. However, for some who take comfort in the familiar, this visionary element may be frightening. Because of the INFJ's tendency to lead with a forward, thinking perspective, people who are averse to change may oppose because they see it as a challenge to established systems. Although INFJs want to encourage change and development, people who would rather stay in the comforts of the present may feel uneasy and afraid of their visionary leadership. For INFJs, finding a balance between moving toward a better future and their innate aversion to change is a difficult task. However, under this tension, there is also room for growth and adjustment as the INFJ works to manage the intricate dynamics of leadership and bring about change in a potentially unwilling to accept the revolutionary idea they present. First place, depth of emotion. An INFJ's deep emotional depth and profound intelligence are intricately entwined, weaving a rich tapestry of emotions that can be both mesmerizing and overwhelming. INFJs explore the emotional nuances that characterize the human experience, establishing relationships at a deep level. Although this emotional intensity is a source of authenticity and depth, it may also be intimidating for those who are ill-prepared to deal with the intricacies of such deep emotional landscapes. Others may unintentionally become overwhelmed by the INFJ's extreme sensitivity leaving them feeling exposed and defenseless in the aftermath of such unadulterated emotional force. For INFJs, it becomes a delicate dance to find a balance between exposing their emotional depth and honoring the emotional boundaries of others. However, 
This emotional depth also harbors the possibility of sincere bonds that go beyond appearances, beckoning those who are brave enough to go deep to find the splendor of meaningful and real human connections. An INFJ's exceptional intelligence, combined with traits like profound empathy, creative thinking, and emotional depth, creates a compelling picture of their character. Although these characteristics give an individual appeal, they may unintentionally make others feel uncomfortable or intimidated. But realizing that these subtleties are a part of the complex dance of human connection offers a chance for development and comprehension. The difficulties posed by an intelligent INFJ's traits are not obstacles to be overcome, but rather avenues toward deeper and more genuine connections. Through negotiating the intricacies, INFJs and those around them can uncover the depth and beauty that these fascinating personalities have, creating relationships that go beyond surface, level interactions, and enhance the fabric of shared experiences. Accepting the complexities of the perceptive INFJ leads to a world of real relationships. And, in the end, the humanity that binds us all on the path of mutual understanding.